Right now, an Orange County Sheriff's deputy is in the hospital after being hit by a car. This is footage from the scene after this happened. The deputy and another then shot the suspect. Overnight, we saw some video of bullet holes in the suspect's car at Orange Blossom Trail and Holden Avenue. This morning, West 2's Chris Hush is there at the scene. So, Chris, how's that injured deputy doing this morning? Well, this morning, deputies describe his condition as promising. Of course, still recovering in the hospita hospital. The two deputies were already patrolling this area because of recent crime. This is Orange Blossom Trail and Holden Avenue. When investigators say the crime came to them. A violent traffic stop leaves three in the hospital, including a suspect and an Orange County Sheriff's deputy. Authorities say when two deputies on patrol stopped a vehicle. The uh, suspect uh, in the vehicle uh, made a U-turn. And rammed his vehicle into the deputy. Investigators say the deputies opened fire, hitting the suspect. The suspect's windshield shows at least seven bullet holes, but deputies have not yet said how many times the suspect was hit. This is a dangerous situation, a terrible situation. The suspect and a passenger in his vehicle were taken to ORMC. It's unclear what injuries the passenger sustained. The deputy hit by the car and found laying on the ground was taken to ORMC as well, where he is recovering. Deputies say his condition is promising and say he's lucky to be alive. This is one instance in which the car was used as a deadly weapon to try and kill one of our deputies, uh, who luckily was able to survive the, being struck by the car. Now we're also told by investigator, investigators that the second deputy that was in the patrol car was not injured. As far as the suspect's name, that has not yet been released. Investigators also tell us that they did search the suspect's vehicle, but have not told us what, if anything, was found inside. Live in Orange County, Chris Hush, West 2 News.